welcome back to my channel. My name is Victoria. Today we're going to be touring this natural hillside villa located in Bangzhou, Phuket. We will tour the showroom of these 12 new off-plan villas from three to four bedrooms. The sizes ranging from 531 square meters up to 1,028 square meter plot of land and the built-up area starting at 319 square meters. This experienced developer is expanding to their seventh project and this one in particular has a starting price at 28 million Thai baht. Can't wait to show you guys around. Let's take a look. We've made it inside of the villa. Now, this is the walkway. We've got a beautiful garden right here, natural stone wall that we'll, you'll see throughout the whole home. Now, through these doors is where we enter, but you can also enter the home from your parking garage right here. Gate, everything is gated. The community, community is gated. You've got 24 hour security, a beautiful place to you know, have your family here, and it's just a lovely community. But let's go straight inside and see what's in there. Now, right as we walk in, we have the shoe closet right here, which is great for convenience right before you head out the door. And this is all kind of a one floor villa. We've got some steps because it does represent a bit of like the hill slopes, but overall, there's not many steps. There's kind of just one floor that blends into the whole living space. Now, right as we walk in, we have this beautiful open area, the living room area, dining room, kitchen in the back. I love how it's just such a nice big space. We've got really tall ceilings, double height ceilings, windows that takes us out onto your outdoor living space, beautiful chandelier hanging up top. Um, and also, if you guys notice up top, we've got these window panels that wraps all around, giving us so much natural lighting and just exaggerating the height of the ceiling. We've got beautiful sanded down wood up on top, goes really well with the vibe of the home. Very natural elements, natural colors, as you can see from this couch right here. Very, very comfortable couch, let me just say. Um, also, the throw pillows are actually from Fendi. I love the colors that they've chosen. It's kind of like a nude color, but adding some little textured pillows right here. Also, a cute little dog bed that my little sister was chilling on because it's actually very comfortable. We've got this round table right here. I love the black accents that they've added into the home. It works really well, as well as all the gold little knickknacks you'll see throughout the whole space because they've used colors as with like dark greens, woods, nudes, and that all goes really, really well with gold hardware. Now on the corner right here, they have the TV stand, a beautiful wooden cabinet with gold accents as well. Now, where do we go? Let's go to the dining first. We've got this beautiful dining table, guys. They've set it up so, so nicely as if you can literally cook and host right now. So we've got this beautiful curved edge um, marble table as well as the curved stands if you notice from the bottom beautiful gold access accents um, this gold base also just the hardware on this stuff it just blends so so nicely and what I really love are these chairs guys it's this dark green leather chair with um, wooden stands which goes so well with the rest of the home and to cook for your guests we have this whole western kitchen right here a beautiful gray island that doubles as a bar as well so we've got three bar stools right there and i love this wooden panel this is the same wood that they use on the ceiling so it matches really well it goes it's very cohesive now on this back wall we have we have <laughs> We have, sorry, I'm so excited to show this home. Keep making little mistakes. 
but we have this whole built-in space. You've got Frank appliances for the stove, the fan right here. You've got double door fridge from Electrolux. On my left-hand side, you've got Frank appliances for the microwave as well as the oven and a plus. I wish I had this in my own home. A dishwasher. Guys, my life would be so much easier with a dishwasher, but we'll move on up later on. Anyways, now that we've wrapped up this open living room space, we're gonna check out the outdoor area because it is such a nice flow onto the lower deck. Now, stepping out of the living room space, we've got this beautiful flow onto this overhang, giving us some nice shaded seating areas. As you can see, we've got two couches on either sides, but since it is off plan, guys, you can customize it however you'd like. You can even put an outdoor dining area right here. I love how this spot is a little bit more elevated than the rest of the garden and the swimming pool. It just gives it such a extravagant and royal feeling to it. It's just like I'm on top of the world looking out onto my garden and my villa. Also, let me just mention really quickly, since this is off plan, the minute you put down that 30% for this home in 14 months, you get a brand new home. Also during these 14 months, you are very much welcome to change and tweak the little spots, whatever you don't like and make it your own home. But in this project, you do have a furniture package. This one is a four bedroom. So the furniture package for a four bedroom is 3.5 million Thai baht. Now the furniture package for the three bedrooms are 3 million Thai baht. So you see all these loose furnishing, furnishers, furnitures, you can come with the home exactly how it is. But if you do wanna make it more of your style and you're not a big fan of it, you could do that. Literally everything is up to you that's the best thing for an off-plan villa. Now, there are 12 plots. All the plots are a little bit different in sizes and the shape. So there are four different types of villas. They all conform to the land plot that you choose, but the layout is pretty much the same. You see the design, it's gonna be just like this, but it'll just conform to the land plot that you choose. Um, so that's the perk of having an off-plan villa. You can customize it for your own sake, or you can buy it as an investment property because once it's finished, the value will go up and you can sell that. But now let's go back into the villa. I'm gonna step down and meet you guys across. Just across the swimming pool here, we've got a beautiful blue grayish tile swimming pool that also doubles as a jacuzzi by the end of it. We've got beautiful landscaping around us. The landscaping comes with the home, the kitchen comes with the home, the Pool, swimming pool comes with the home. What else? Um, anything built in like the built-in closet. So everything that is built in obviously comes with home. Furniture package is also included if that's what you want. But here we have a beautiful wooden deck. It is shaded once you come a little bit closer. This is honestly the perfect spot to hang out on a Sunday in the swimming pool, lounging. We've got a ceiling fan up on top and it's just a nice cozy space. You're surrounded by nature looking back into the home it's so so gorgeous i love as i said before the elevated um living room space it just brings in so much like grand and also guys as i mentioned before the natural stone walls that we saw from the entrance it's also implemented here right in front of the master bedroom this Villa also has a little rooftop deck, which we will get to a little bit later. But first, I want to take you guys into the master bedroom, which is at the end of the swimming pool. We've made it into the master bedroom. Now the master bedroom has a stunning view of this tropical villa. The bed is literally facing towards the swimming pool. Open the sliding doors, you can literally wake up and take a dip in your swimming pool. We've got the TV right here, a beautiful stand that is 
also soft edges. I love how they've smoothed all the furniture, giving it such a nice and sleek vibe. You'll see a lot of that throughout the home with the furniture pieces, soft edges. Now through the back here, we have the built-in closet, his and hers. In between, we've got a vanity space with a large mirror. Perfect also that it's placed right here because it's reflecting light just outside from the swimming pool area. And then through here, the ensuite. Now, in this ensuite, we've got the marble floors that matches with the counters for the sink right here. We've got double sinks, this beautiful and sleek single standing bathtub. It just looks so smooth and it feels really smooth. Now, in front of me, we've got the shower, a waterfall shower as well. And in the master, we've got hardwood floors, but I love the switch up into the bathroom, having it be marble and matching it with the counter tops right here as well as this natural stone wall they've kind of stacked it up giving us some more texture into the bathroom not making it so bland even though it is all the same color love it also on the back wall here instead of having just a plain wall they've added um, trees and plants all around giving you a nice ambience even when you're in your bathroom now let's go back into the hallway because we have three more bedrooms to check out come on now the master bedroom is on the same level as the pool deck so it is a bit sunken in giving it a really nice privacy and its own space now up the steps through here is the first guest bedroom now this guest bedroom has the ensuite right here that also doubles as the powder room. The same design as you saw in the master bedroom, beautiful marble floors. Um, instead, there's only one sink, but here is the bedroom. We've got this soft headboard. I love this and I love how it comes out a little bit. So you know, you might not fall off the bed or it just feels cozy. The bed is facing towards these sliding doors, giving you so much natural lighting into this room. Beautiful cove lighting on top. I love the picture that they've chosen. It goes really well with the side table, this wooden circle side table right here, as well as this lampshade. Inside of the lampshade is this gold like sheet, so it reflects warm light into the room. Now in front of me, we've got the built-in closet that also um, expands out into a vanity space. Now that we've seen this, let's go to the next guest bedroom. Here we are in the second guest bedroom. This one is a little bit darker in the furnitures and instead they've used like silver accents. Guys, this nightstand is so beautiful. It is a leather um, nightstand with beautiful rounded edges. It blends so nicely with the leather and the rest of the home. We also have this TV stand right here with curved edges. It's a beautiful touch to it. This sliding door, once again, every single room has so much natural lighting, which is perfect. Um, and yeah, beautiful, lovely guest bedroom. This one's a little bit bigger than the other one. And we have these doors that take us into the ensuite. In the ensuite, we've got the built-in closet right here. Again, matching the floors with the sink top. And I like how it's got a little bit of a nude and brown colors to it. So it goes really well with this wooden cabinet that they've chosen. We've got the waterfall shower there and over here, a nice vanity space for the girlies to get ready in the morning. Now we're gonna go all the way across the living room space because that's where the last bedroom is. Now this guest bedroom is positioned right by the main entrance. We have the bathroom right through here and a little bit further along this bedroom is so, so nice. It's elevated a little bit up on the same level as the living room space, but you still get the stunning view of the landscaping, the swimming pool. Um, through the back wall here, the built-in closet that also doubles as the vanity space. I really do love the cho choice of wood that they've used. It just brings in such nice natural elements. Again, a soft headboard and this beautiful 
TV stand that has marbles and black wood all around it. It's just lovely. And now I am going to bring you guys all the way up there to the terrace. Let's go. Woo! Guys, we are up on the top deck, which is the sala. We have this nice shaded seating area that looks out onto the rest of your home. It's a beautiful sight. I also love all the trees that are surrounding us. We have a very traditional Thai um, tree right here on the left, which you can literally pick out from your home and eat it with your som tam. A lot of people eat it with som tam. If you haven't tried it, try it. Also, you've got a coconut tree right there. You can literally climb up or wait for it to fall down and have coconut on demand because it's literally right there in every single home. This landscape is just so, so gorgeous. But now that we've officially wrapped up this tour, if you would like to know any more information about this new development, please click the link in my description box below. It'll take you guys straight to the Sea Property team and they will take great care of you as well as give you all the information that you are asking for. As well, if you wanna see more house tours, please don't forget to like and subscribe. My name is Victoria and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.